Hey, Longview nonprofit's home is in limbo tonight after the building they operated went up for sale. Our Jesus Martinez talked to the director of the One Love Longview and the building's owner about the future plans of One Love. If you know One Love Longview, you know the resources they offer to the community. With care coordination, facility placement, we help with housing, disability applications. Uh, and it's a lengthy list. Issues, we help get people IDs, birth certificates, uh, state IDs, and social security cards. Their focus is on the unhoused population in the area. But we really don't turn anyone away. Amanda Vesey is the director of One Love Longview and says they were told about the building being sold ahead of time and went ahead and agreed to lease it to us for an additional year, longer than we agreed, and so here we are now at the end of that second year. VC says there's no controversy in that sale, it's just business. We did some negotiating and haven't been able to come up with a number that works for both of us. Right now we're just uh, month to month uh, um, on leasing it to him, yes. Steve Carroll is the owner of the building where One Love Longview sits off McCann Road. He says he's selling the building because he's retiring. He's selling the building for $650,000 and hopes the nonprofit and the community can raise enough money to buy it. Right now, Carroll says he's not in the financial position to donate the building, but supports the nonprofit. Steve, the owner, is happy with us being here um, until the building sells and whatever that looks like. For now, One Love Longview is leasing the building month by month until there's a new owner. I have. I have every intention of being here until the answer is clear and I can put my feet on the ground at the next place or at this one or wherever else uh, we happen to land. In Longview, Jesus Martinez, CBS 19.